A young Chicago man might be deported next week because he says Chicago police call him a gang member. CBS 2's Jim Williams reports he's going to federal court to fight it. 25 year old Luis Petrote Salinas has been in Chicago since he was five, brought here by his parents from Mexico. I put my sweat in this city, I put my sweat in this country. I, be, I believe I'm a law abiding citizen and I never committed nothing wrong. But his attorneys contend Chicago police falsely put Petrone Salinas in a gang database after he was arrested at 19 for having an unopened can of beer in a southwest side gang territory. He's got no way to challenge that designation, no way to get off of that database. Uh, the, his only option is this federal lawsuit. A lawsuit against the city of Chicago and the police department. Because he's been labeled a gang member, Petrote Salinas is scheduled to be deported to Mexico next week, where his pastor fears he could be targeted by drug cartels under the wrong impression. If the thought is that they're deported because they're gang members, because those deportations are taking place now, uh, then they move right away to recruit them. And if they don't join, they kill them. Petrote Salinas is adamant he's never been in a gang. But when he was 16, he got an Aztec warrior tattoo, similar to this one, worn by some gang members. Did you know that it might have represented a gang, or was it, did you just like the design of it? I just like the design, yeah, you know. Petrote Salinas' pastor says police superintendent Eddie Johnson himself said he would have the young man's name removed from the gang database, but never did it. The police spokesman told us the department does not comment on any pending litigation. Live in the newsroom, Jim Williams, CBS 2 News. Rob? So, Jim, even though he's filed this lawsuit now, he could still get deported next week. How, how would that impact the, the lawsuit moving forward? W what they're hoping is that the judge, in hearing this case, will say, let's stop the deportation, hear the case, and uh, settle it after that. Okay. Jim Williams, live in the newsroom. Thank you. Coming up.